Rip up Broadway from end to end. They do that every day. Do you take sinners here? Indeed we do. Sarah, how do you do? Name's Abernathy, Arvida Abernathy. Sky Masterson. Oh, oh. What's wrong? Oh, my heart, it's heavy with sin. You poor man. I've wasted my life in gambling and evil betting. But I've suddenly realized the terrible things that betting can lead to. Agatha, coffee. But didn't I see you a uh, while ago on Broadway? Possibly. I've, I've been walking around trying to get the courage to come in here. And you're willing to give up gambling? Certainly. I never would have become a gambler in the first place had I not fallen in with evil companions who were always offering me sucker bets. Thank you. You know, it makes me feel good just to talk to you people. You go right ahead and talk with Sister Sarah. It'll be okay. We're so glad you found us. Well, the Bible says, seek and you shall find. Very good. I wish we could find more sinners like you. We're out there every day trying. Well, have you tried the night time? Why is that? As a former sinner, I happen to know the best time to find sinners is between the hours of midnight and dawn. You might even try holding an all-night session against the devil. That's a very good suggestion. Thank you, Brother Masterson. You're welcome. Hmm. Coffee is so good. I don't know why it isn't a sin. <laughs> Fine, old lady. I suppose she sort of looks after you. Well, you look after each other. Uh-huh. And I suppose if one of you goes someplace, the other goes along. Yes, of course. Of course. And here are two of our pamphlets i like you to read. They will give you a good deal of comfort. Thanks. And we're holding a midnight prayer meeting on Thursday, which I'm sure you'll wish to attend. I'm sure. Uh, Miss Sarah, I hope you won't think that I'm out of line when I say I think it's wonderful to see a pretty doll, like a, a nice looking lady like you sacrificing herself for others. I mean, staying here in this place, and you ever go anyplace else? Travel or anything? I'd like to go to Africa. That's a bit far. But there are a lot of wonderful places only a few hours from New York by plane. You ever been in a plane? No. Oh, it's wonderful. <laughs> uh, here's another pamphlet I think you should read. Thank you. You know, I think I'm going to need a lot of personal help. My heart is as black as two feet down a wolf's skull. I'll be at Thursday's midnight prayer meeting. I think I might need private lessons. Why don't, why don't we have dinner or something? I think not, Mr. Masterson. I'm sorry. I'm just blossoming under the warmth of your kindness. Hey, that's wrong. What's wrong? Uh, that's Isaiah, not Proverbs. It's, it's Proverbs. This, sorry. Uh, no peace under the wicked is Isaiah chapter 57, verse uh, 22. Isaiah? Isaiah. There's two things been in every hotel room in the country. Sky Masterson and the Gideon Bible. I must have read the good book like 10 or 12 times. You read the Bible 12 times. What's wrong with the Bible? Besides, in my line of work, the strangest information frequently comes in handy. I once won five G's on a parlay, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. Tell me, Mr. Masterson, why are you here? I told you, I'm a sinner. You're lying. Lying's a sin. Look, <laughs> I'm a big sinner. If you get me at St. Fabio's of all, you need sinners, don't you? We're managing. Let's be honest, this mission is laying an egg. I, I bet I could fill this place with sinners. <laughs> I don't bet. A proposition bet. When's that big meeting of yours? Next Thursday? I will guarantee to supply you with one dozen genuine sinners for the old meeting. And I will also make sure that they will sit still and listen to you. And um, what's my end of the bargain? Have dinner with me. Why do you want to have dinner with me? I'm hungry. Here. What's this? That is Sky Masterson's marker. You don't think it's good, ask anybody in town. I owe you 12 cents. I'll pick you up for dinner tomorrow at noon. 
at noon.